want to support me, go to Nene Marie 37 on Instagram and purchase you a signed copy of my book. That's Nene Marie 37. Yo! It's your boy Trench the News, and I'm back at y'all with another one. Appreciate all the support. Thanks for everyone who subscribed to the channel. If you ain't subbed to my channel, make sure you do. Make sure you join the membership. Shout out to the Real Mod Squad, man. If you ain't following my mods, make sure you follow their ads at the end of the video. Remember, if you support me, support my mods, man. They got content too. I'd rather you learn something and get real information than made up information. That's why I tell you to follow my mods, just in case I ain't here. Hey. With that being said, man, if you got anything extra, food, hygiene, clothes, bag it up, take it outside to give it to the less fortunate. Remember, we all one step away from being homeless. I don't care how much money you say you got. Y'all seen them tornadoes the other day looking real scary on it. Um, so make sure you get back. Let's say the kids, the women, the elderly, and the neutrons, man, who don't gain bang. Let's say them, man. With that being said, smash that like button. I need this video to get around, man. We got two stories, man. We got Boosie. We got Boosie, Boosie, Boo. Um, we're gonna talk about Lil Boosie, man, and him beating his Fed case, and then the Feds coming and indicting him as an addict. They saying he's an addict, he's an arm habitual, um, a, a gun addict, man. We're gonna talk about that, and we're gonna talk about eight hundred TJ funeral, man. Um, people are calling the funeral home. I seen it on Facebook on this people page that people is calling funeral home, talking about that they just gonna shoot up. His funeral and all that. And don't none of the funeral homes want to deal with it, man. Let's smash that like button. We're going to get into all this. I need y'all to smash that like button, though, man. That's all I ask. Smash that like button. Um, with that being said, Lil Boosie, man. Hey, we just seen Lil Boosie celebrating with his lawyers. Laughing. Walking out the um the, the, the courthouse. um Crying on live. Going on Vlad saying that how he beat his Fed case. Now, Boosie got locked up in California. Um, through some drones. They said the drones had seen um the activity and when they got to Boosie to the truck, they got they got the guns out the car. Now we know um people were saying that he blamed the security guard. We know that the security guard was taking his way for his gun, which is allowed, but it was another gun, which they were saying was Boosie's. And um Boosie had got out on bond. First he ain't get out, he got out on bond and um he was on ankle monitor. We seen him at plenty of shows. Um, BET Awards, he was drunk, um, act showing out, um, saying shout out to his lawyers and all that. And um, then Boosie um, had, um, he beat the case. He ended up beating the case a year, I say a year or something. He beat the case and um, boy, he thought he beat the case. Now Boosie, he um, beat life sentences and all that, man. You know, it was a kid um, that he had custody of. That, that got life that um was running around killing people for Boosie and uh this public record too. They was running around doing shit for Boosie and Boosie was supposed to be his guardian and um now the guy, Marlo Mike, he in jail for the rest of his life and Boosie out here living his best life. Um so karma, I just call it karma, man. I just call it karma, man. I don't think Boosie will ever live right knowing that uh, you know what I'm talking about the shit that he been through. And everybody else gone or lost their life. And he the only one that's still alive, man. That's still alive and still got money to to do it. You know, if I was Boosie, I'd still look out for Marlo, man. Because deep inside, you know that, you know, he stepped on niggas of your enemies that's gone. So you ain't got to worry about them even if you is free. Because he took care of all your problems. But Boosie has been um, retried by the feds. So all you guys who out there who be talking about, um, oh, once you beat the feds, they can't come back. This is not the states. This is not the states, bro. If you beat a state case, the feds could come pick you up. They a bigger entity. You know what I'm saying? The, the, the feds could come and get you on um some more charges. But they got Boosie for the same gun they threw out. And then they came, got him a um, couple of days later. I just seen Boosie crying with his lawyers. He was on Vlad saying how he beat his case. And you know what I'm saying? How God is good and all that, man. I'm just saying, man. Hey, y'all, look. Them, some people don't just don't give up, man, until they gone. I think Boosie, he was laughing in their face and all that, and I think they they um they gonna get him this time. If they came with some charges, he gonna have to cop out or do some time or damn near go broke. You seen him have to sell his own cars and shit for bond money, but that's what you buy cars for. It's material things. So once you go to jail and shit, that's what drug does and everything. You gotta start selling shit. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's the that's what's on Boosie, man. They filed, refiled charges. Boosie has been re-indicted, man. They said he an addict. 
been reindicted as an addict gun um, slinger, what we call the arm of bitch in Chicago. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens. I'll report back on y'all. I really don't report on Boosie, but I had to report on this, man. Um, then we got 800 TJ. I seen it on his family members' pages, man. One of his family members' pages, they said, it's a damn shame that you can't even um, plan a burial without people. They, they People is calling the, the funeral home, telling them that they going to shoot it up. That's crazy, man. That Now, that's crazy work. You know, 800 TJ was down here, ton of people and all that, bro. But that's crazy work for having his family go through that. But he had other families go through that. I understand what y'all going to say. But look at this. Check this out. You know. You got to go one day, and I just hope you don't want to go the same way that he went and knowing that somebody going to be telling your family and smoking on you all day and all that, bro. That ain't healthy, bro. That ain't that ain't healthy at all, man. But TJ, uh, watch, they going to hire him the best funeral, um, the walls, the horses and carriage. Hey, people don't live life, man. They want to ball out when they going out, but they don't want to live life. That's weird too, right? Yeah, that's what that's 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 um really insane, bro. That you know what I'm talking about when you was here, you didn't you you didn't want to ride no horse and carriage. When you was here, you didn't want to go out. You couldn't go past your community. You passed the gun line, boss. You know what I'm saying? Unless you you know riding around and some stolen with guns or riding around the car. Y'all got eight guns, which is which is illegal. So you should taking your chances of going to jail just to go to a corner store, man. That ain't the life to live. That ain't the way to live. But 800 TJ, man, seeing his family member say that, man, I just thought I had to report about that, too. Because that's really fucking weird, man. They already put out his death pics. They talking about his mama took his dreads off. And, man, his mama ain't going to drop his pics knowing that your weirdos going to take his picture and turn it into something else. You know, I don't think his family would do that. You know, whoever at that hospital, they are finna get a HIPAA violation. But yeah, um, to call a funeral home and tell a funeral home if they had a funeral that they gonna shoot it up. Man, now that's diabolical work. Man, y'all get in the comments and let me know what y'all think. Hey, remember, man, Duck Album will be streaming, dropping August 4th, 2024, man. Make sure y'all go and support Duck, man. If you love the music. If you don't, don't get on my page talking about nothing trash, none of that. I'm going to block your ass, all right? You know what I'm talking about? Hey, so if you want to support me, go to Nene Marie 37 on Instagram and purchase you a signed copy of my book. I got a DJ Vlad coming out. I got a Made Media magazine. I just got to get up with him and we do the interview. But yeah, I got some interviews coming. And if you want to interview me, hit up Nene Marie 37 on Instagram, man. Um, my management company, who I'm signing with, um, I'm going to have their information for y'all soon. So, y'all, if y'all want to do interviews, you got to go through them to get to Trenches News, man. Hey, but my man is my nine. Shout out to the Mod Squad, man. I will be going live tonight, man. Hey, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Follow my mods, man. My man is my nine. Use your head for more than a head rack, man. I'm